WFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We had the Dow Industrials finish up uh, 90, NASDAQ down 51, S&P's up 8.5. Gold, gold contract down $9.20, traded 1736 an ounce. We had silver down 29 cents, $18.33 an ounce. Light sweet crude up a buck and a half. A trade down to the price point of $96.75 a barrel. Notes and bonds. You had the 10-year note trading down four ticks at 119.24. The 30 off 12 at 141.23 in King Dollar. King Dollar. Down 294 ticks at 106,436. The euro is at 102. The yen's at 136. And the British pound is at 120 to 1 US dollar. I'm going to get over to the 10 year. And the reason I want to go over to the 10 year, I meant to go over it in my program, is this. The 10 year, folks, last week, okay, came in with volume as it goes into its swing point. The 10 year is projecting. A potential ABC structure on the way up, and it's a big one, man. So picture, the first swing point that it was going after is 1.6 million contracts. Well, we did 1.79 million contracts on Friday. That's telling me that we're going to blow that away, and the B point on this is 120.16. Your A point is the 114. It's approximately six bucks, which is going to get you up into the uh, 124 area. Now, if that's what you get, folks, this thing is laying out coming into the Fed announcement. So that's telling me whatever they say, okay, is that on a basis of the next two or three months that we are actually going to see rates go down, not go up. And you got to remember something, that the Fed fund rate is the bank rate bank to bank. It's not the 10-year. The 10-year is what's predicated for all the mortgages, your credit cards, all the above. So the bottom line, if this 10-year is going to do an ABC structure up, let me tell you, that means that the dollar's topped, that rates are going to come down, and that would be saying to me that, you know, you're going to see a rally. And that would be the most deviant thing the market could do, particularly because this is the worst time of the year, coming right up till October. The 10-year right now is uh, trading 2.8%. Uh, but the way it's set up, man, particularly because see, if we look at this again today, what you're going to see is that... We pulled back, we went higher Friday with 1.67 million contracts. We pulled back today with 942,000, man. It wants higher price. Lower rates are coming at us. Deviant, amazing. Have a great one, folks. Have a safe one. Come back and visit Tommy tomorrow morning. Kicks us off 9 o'clock in the morning. Great show, huge amount of earnings. Yeah, we'll get them, folks.